everybody, welcome back to the channel. How are you doing today? Hopefully this finds you well. And yes, I am not in a shop. I went on a little bit of a trip. And no, of course I didn't drive. As you saw, I had to fly. I am in Utah. I am in Park City, Utah. And I'm in a really cool place. This is the Blue Sky Lodge. Yours truly got an invitation to go hang out with a bunch of folks here at Park City and to drive the 2020 Nissan Titan as well as do some uh, trap and skeet shooting, I think. So we're gonna shoot some clays and I'm gonna go fly fishing and I'm taking you guys along for the ride. But check this out. The Blue Sky just opened up in June and Nissan went ahead and reserved the entire lodge. And this place is amazing. So look at this. Now, this is the first floor. So this is where you enter. Okay, that's the ent entrance right there, okay. Here's the hall bath. I mean, look at this, this is so cool. And there's wood, there's tile, there's stone, there's rock, it is something else. And check this out in front of me. Okay, so this is the living room. Beautiful, it's got that new smell. And I heard too, all the drawings in here are from the art, artists and, and there's rock collecting, everything's done in house. Uh, and the horses, in my room in particular, they're all horses that were drawn from here on the property. Blue Sky, this resort, this ranch, is 3,500 acres. That is amazing, but this room is what's amazing. Apparently, I have one of the three largest rooms. Check this out, oh. Here's bedroom number one. It's like an episode of Cribs, even though I've never seen that show before. I just see people talk about it all the time. So again, here's a view that what you guys saw earlier. This is bedroom number one. Bedroom number one is facing east. Let me see if I can get some lights turned on, but look at this, this is something else. Oh, let's see here. Oop. Get some lights turned on here, what's going on? I don't know, there's lights here, but look at this shower. Look at this thing. It's got the stone, river rock. Oh, this thing is amazing. Come around here now because bedroom number two is back here. And again, this is just, I, I am so out of my element right now. This is just, it's just amazing, that's right. But check this out, this is bedroom number two, and this is the one that was recommended to me, so I guess I'm staying in here, they had my luggage there. Uh, but uh, really nice, the stone, hopefully the stone comes in here. Man, the ISO is just killing me here. Look at that stone, that is amazing, look at that. Oh, I love this, another television, another great view that we have out here. I have one of, the, like I said, one of the three rooms that are this big, the two bedrooms. And then here's the, uh, the other bathroom. So, I mean, everything is so nice and fancy. This, it looks like a marble. I'm not really sure though, but that's beautiful there. And then of course, I got a big soaking tub. Big soaking tub and another one of these showers. Oh. Nissan has, it's just amazing. I, I have been so, amazed and so humbled by the treatment so far. Met some really good people already uh, on the ride in. We got picked up uh, at the airport and driven in in a brand new uh, 2020 Armada and uh, got dropped off here. Uh, just, yeah, it's cool. So uh, yeah, so today is Thursday. Uh, so we're gonna go uh, chill for a little bit. Then we're gonna go do some uh, uh, shooting. And then after that, we're coming back and then we're gonna have dinner. And then tomorrow we're going out and we're gonna be doing uh, on-road and off-road courses here on the property. And then we're gonna go fly fishing. And then there's another dinner and stuff and, and lunches and everything. So it's really cool. So I'm gonna hopefully get some video of this weekend and share it with you all. But uh, first and foremost, thank you, Nissan USA. I am so amazed, so grateful. I feel so blessed. Thank you for this opportunity. And uh, everybody else, hopefully this video turns out okay. So. Let's get cracking. Okay, now we're here, we're set up. We came up on the hilltop and uh, we all get to drive uh, a Titan. So we get turns. Connor drove up, I'm driving down, but now we are here because we're gonna go ahead and get some shotguns and start doing a little shooting, some clay. I'm actually looking forward to this one. This ought to be fun. So today, we're gonna to be practicing some recoil therapy. So we're gonna get out on the course, do some shooting, get up in the five stand, and then I heard there's a little competition uh, to see who the winner is out of the first two groups. Yes. Hey guys, 
guys. Well, we're just wrapping up our, our clays. Uh, having a blast, you can probably hear that in the background. Uh, we had a little competition at the end here and uh, everybody got 12 shots on, on their target and most hits, wins, I think it's a Yeti cooler. And so uh, those guys are doing really good. I did not do very good. Shotgun trap ski, not one of my biggest fortes. I haven't tr shot clay in probably 30 years. So uh, it's definitely very, very, very rusty. Some of these guys were knocking out of the park. It was awesome. It's been a really good time. And uh, the guys here hosting this, it was great. I had Henry Sr. as my instructor, and uh, he was a very gracious and cordial instructor. So thank you, Mr. Henry, I do appreciate it. Uh, everybody else here has been phenomenal with hosting it. So we're gonna wrap this up, and then we're heading back for drinks and dinner and uh, wrap up the rest of the day, I think. I think that's what it is. Got a list right here, but I didn't bring my reading glasses. Yeah, yeah, it's that kind of way. <laughs> Hit the wrong button on you. Beautiful. This is, look at this behind me. Uh, I was hooking up with some of the guys and we walked around and we were actually giving each other uh, tours of our cribs. It was kind of fun. <laughs> so uh, uh, Marty and Nick and Max, good hanging out with you guys as i said guys uh 2019 has been quite quite overwhelming and i'm very humbled and blessed and i thank everybody because this kind of stuff wouldn't have happened without folks like you so i'm gonna go take care of my business and i'll see you guys later on you've already experienced some of it today with our shooting and it was just fun we hope you all enjoyed it when you are sure if you've heard we had major and most of the group here are titan consumers we also have a very special group of influencers out here they basically do lifestyle type influence on social media they're joining us as well because the way we're marketing this truck is a little different we want to make sure that people understand this is a truck to be used we're going to show you how to use it the next couple of days by towing by off-road living the best life we can in a titan and have a good time Good morning, everybody. Well, good morning for me. It's a little, it's around 6.30, 6.45 in the morning. I am showered, bright-eyed, and bushy-tailed. Eh, sort of. Oh, sorry about that. Um, yeah, there's a, uh, uh, I saw everything else. I'm moving from room to room. Sorry about that. But yep, yeah, I am ready to rock and roll. I am going to head out, and uh, we're going to have breakfast, and then uh, we're going to start driving. So I'm going to see how much footage I can get and how much excitement I can show y'all. But uh, got to get my coffee and my grub out, so let's get started. Oh, sorry about that, son, guys. Let me see if I can work on some shading here. Uh, we're here now. We're over and a building and we're gonna go through the on-road course and get a little 101 about everything that's taking place for today. I got some phenomenal looking trucks back here behind me and uh, trying to help you with the, the overexposure here, guys. Sorry about that. Uh, got some Pro 4Xs back behind us and then we got some of the Platinums down here for some of the road courses that we're gonna do. And then also later on, we're gonna be doing towing. So really exciting day today. And uh, thanks again to Nissan USA for inviting me out. And uh, the gang has been phenomenal hosting us, getting everybody moved around and being quite patient with some of the folks that I'm with. So let's get going. Again, uh, like Scott said, really appreciate you guys joining us. Um, 
the, this, what's on the screen now, as Scott mentioned, is we've got a collection of, you might recognize some of the trucks up there, your comments, and then in 2019, we won the JD Power Initial Quality Award. We were the only full-size pickup truck in the top 10, and we were seventh out of 257 vehicles. Most of you know, uh, Titan is backed by America's Best Truck Warranty, five years with 100,000 miles, that's best in the segment, okay? Everybody else is at three years, 36,000. Titan, uh, with that reliability, we stand behind the truck at five years, 100,000 miles. Freaks that final drive ratio to improve that towing and off-road performance. You'll see that in the video. And then from 50 to 70 miles an hour, we actually get a full second of improved performance. I, um, you see the picture up here. I mean, you can see it. it this, this truck has a, uh, a presence about it, a commanding presence. But not just that, uh, it also has a high-tech appeal to it. I mean, look at the headlights the LED fog lamps. Chris talked a lot about the technology enhancements on the vehicle. Blind spot warning when you notice on the, on the mirror. Alrighty, we just went through our little safety briefing, I think it might have been, is yeah. what they're calling it. But a really good intro to everything. Look, who let the Toyota in here? Come on, <laughs> I tell you. They didn't let anybody in this place. But Carrie and I are in the uh, Platinum. Yeah. This thing is phenomenal. So Leather. That's all right. I can't wait for the sunroof to open I'm up like, once you I'm guys like, see no these things. It is there's amazing. Uh, so, yeah. It, I mean, wood grain type dashboard. What do you like I mean, about I'll, this? I was That's hoping beautiful. to drive the it's red new, because it matches uh, my shirt. New bigger uh, screen in the center of the uh, console here. Uh, bigger, yeah. bigger screen here. Yeah, look at that cow. That is huge. And HD. It's, you know. Yeah, it's really slick. So, see, I got a 2017. Oh yeah, SV, and I had a little screen and such, but boy, that is something else. It's That's nice. so much more vibrant too. Yeah. Oh wow, but oh, I'm looking forward to this. So we're gonna hit the roads first, the pavement. We're gonna drive around for a little bit, and then we come back and we do some off-road driving. I think we're going to Park City Loop first, and then we'll do some off-road, and then we'll do uh, some towing capabilities. There we go. So we're all Carrie and I are looking so forward to this. This is my shooting buddy too. So. <laughs> I, I hang with him because he made me look bad. So it's like, <laughs> I mean, I got, a, I got a shotgunner over here. So, but uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to this. So let's get cracking. Okay, well, I guess I get a chance to drive yeah. now because I, I just told Carrie, I said, hey, I didn't care about driving. You know, I, I got mine. I got my SV. <laughs> yeah. So I wanted to get hit, him to get everything. We didn't think we were changing, so this is cool. Yeah, thank you. So, uh, yeah, so I'm looking forward to this. I'm going to see what the pedal lag is like because I was telling Carrie about that iDrive that a lot of you know about from my channel. I put that iDrive in my SV to, to help with that pedal lag and to really get it up and going. So I'm really curious to see if Nissan changed that at all, that sensitivity in the pedal. So I'm gonna put it for its test. Plus maybe Carrie will do a better job navigating because uh, I had us miss a couple of turns. We were too busy jaw jacking and uh, I didn't have my readers on. So, <laughs> oh, getting old socks. <laughs> Oh, 
Okay, folks, we didn't get much footage for off-road. Uh, I let Carrie do a lot of uh, the off-road driving because, as you guys know, I've done a lot already with my Nissan Titan. Um, it's just neat to see some of the extra things, especially with the crawl control that they offer. And if you're not familiar with the crawl control, you just hit a button and let off on the gas and it'll help you gauge, uh, control your descent downhill, rock climbing and stuff like that. So it's really cool. And it saves you from having to downshift or anything. So that was a really good bonus. Uh, we did some really cool off camber stuff. I mean, it's like, uh, I forgot what the degree Brett said, but uh, turned out really good. Uh, and then of course we got to go see the SEMA truck. That's right, the SEMA Titan was up on top of the hill. That thing is beautiful. So much good materials in it. And I'll put something in here. They actually had the upper control arms by Dirk King, the same ones I have with the Moog ball joints. I love mine and they did it for theirs. So that tells you something. So something to keep an eye on gang. So if you have a Nissan or if you're thinking about doing some work, you might want to check that out. So I did the 5100 series, Pro 4X 4900 series, both good shocks. Check out what you like. Uh, and there's other companies now coming out and trying to get on board with Nissan. And uh, that'll come later on in other videos and stuff, hopefully. But uh, I'm not sure what else is going to happen other than we're going to go have some lunch. And I'm going fly fishing. And I'm going to take you guys with me to go see how I do. I just told everybody, don't stand next to me because I've never fly fished before. I don't want to be responsible for snagging anybody. <laughs> Okay guys, so I didn't get any footage, uh, just towing part. Uh, really don't want to start trying to videotape. I drove the entire time, uh, so there and back again, so I didn't get any footage. It wasn't too exciting, except for the fact that with this new 9-speed transmission I have, it was so smooth. Uh, a lot of you guys know that when you go ahead and you're like gunning it to do to pass somebody, you get that, that tranny hit sometimes, you kind of feel it, like that when it drops down into gear to pass somebody, that doesn't happen here so smooth I and mean, you're at 55 60 miles an hour you punch it and go 75 80 85 miles an hour you're on it no time and you never once feel that transmission hit that that thump that thump also you got that pedal to the floor it is just non-stop it feels like you're 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 not running out of power it just keeps going so that was really impressive so we're done with everything now so we're going to start heading back and uh we're going to go get some lunch because it's after one o'clock hey guys how you doing well uh, as you can see the lighting is it's not very good here for for video and uh I'm on auto, maybe I should be on manual, but I want to change it now. Uh, I'm chilling here with uh, Planet of the Apes. I got the patio door open right now to cool this place down. And uh, we're done uh, wrapping it up. Most of us are all already in our rooms, in our suites, our lodges. And um, some guys got it pretty early tomorrow, but I got to be up at 6.30, catch a flight at 11, and then back home again. Um, it was great, it was a good time. Uh, Tony, Scott, Oh, Jeremy, uh, Travis, Marty, Carrie, <clears throat> Wendy, Chris, David. Ah, man, all the names, all the over... Oh, light's bad again. All the names, all the information. It is overwhelming. I'm sorry, Alex. Uh, I'm I, missing you guys and not saying everybody's name, but um, doesn't mean I didn't enjoy your company. Uh, again, thank you for watching. Hopefully this video wasn't too bad, wasn't too long. And um, thank you for the support. So remember, like, share, subscribe, all the good stuff. Keep me from the bottom of the YouTube bucket. We'll see you all on the next video.